Hey Joe, it's Sam Hersom here at Prime Mercedes here in Scarborough, Maine on this beautiful Friday morning. Uh, I was uh, given your information by Nick Dargy. He is a service advisor here. He said you were interested in this car to my right. So uh, let me dive into the explanation. The 2021 Mercedes-Benz GLE 580. Uh, so there are different trim levels for the GLE. There's the 350, uh, 450, and then of course 580. 580 having the uh, the biggest engine it has the v8 engine just shy of 500 horsepower um, so you're getting in this car the same while well, similar v8 than you would get in an amg car uh, the major difference is going to be the price you're still going to get the engine in this just for a much lower price there are some similarities and differences i'll go over them as we walk around the car up front, I want to talk about this car because it does have a driver assistance package. Um, so right behind the Silver Star, there is radar, and that is going to um, calculate how far in front of you the car is uh, and help keep you a certain distance based on whatever settings you choose. It's also going to help uh, when you have the cruise control uh, set the speed so if you're in a 65 mile an hour zone and you come into a 45 mile an hour the car is going to slow down to 45 miles per hour um, some styling cues I want to mention up front you do see some uh, chrome trim elements here along the bottom along right here and even on the grill with the diamond studs I want you to keep that in mind as we walk down the side because I'm going to go into uh, why that's so important this does have the quote AMG package because it is uh, a 580 so with that package you're going to get the painted uh, wheel arches here uh, as well as that diamond studded grill up front now I did mention some of those chrome accents up front and I told you to keep in mind because we have more all the way down the side so you see around the windows here you see on the top so those elements combined with the black paint in these gray accented wheels just come together unbelievably uh, from the outside really really uh, a well-built car in case you're wondering the uh, wheels on this are the 21 inch uh, multi-spoke with gray accents so you can see the gray coloring right in there this one does have running boards so um, if a shorter person were to get in they can certainly use those to help um, get in now around the back, we do have GLE 580 and 4MATIC badging. 4MATIC is, of course, Mercedes-Benz version of all-wheel drive. This particular 4MATIC GLE does have an air suspension, so um, you're going to be basically driving on a cloud uh, suspension-wise, and at the same time, you're going to have the power of that big 4-liter V8 in the car. Uh, trailer hitch down below, and again, some more chrome accents down along the bottom and right here. Uh, that all help to tie the car together. Uh, the black exterior with the macchiato beige interior uh, and some of the accents just looks outstanding. Uh, open the trunk in the back here. Uh, plenty of storage. It is a full-size SUV, so um, that's going to be nice to have. Cargo cover that does come with the car as well, and you can kind of begin to see the, um, the macchiato beige interior. Uh, now, this car does have the aromatic suspension, as I mentioned, and the back of it is actually adjustable. So if you come to the car uh, with a handful of groceries or something like that, you can press the button here, and this is actually going to lower the rear end of the car a little bit um, to help get things. If you have uh, maybe an elderly dog or something and you want to help them up in there, this is actually going to drop a significant amount uh, to help you be able to do that. Uh, once you close the trunk, and then hop in the driver's seat the car does of course raise back up uh, for a level driving position one last thing on the outside is this spoiler on the back uh, a lot of GLEs don't have this but we ordered it with this spoiler so that gives it a really really sporty look almost AMG like look on the exterior uh, okay enough of the exterior let's go on the inside I got some things to show you in there all right hey Joe now that we're inside um, I do want to point some things out in here um, starting of course with the most obvious the interior the macchiato beige interior um, now these are comfort seats so you can see uh, the way the uh, side bolsters kind of hug you and uh, in addition to the the side bolsters being there um, also here in the driver's seat same thing you're going to have plenty of support going around 
uh, corners and plenty of comfort on those long road trips. Uh, can come over to the, uh, I'm gonna hop back in, we can take a look at the door over here. Uh, we do have the multi-memory seat function here. Uh, three different driving positions. We do have heated seats uh, and ventilated seats, both for the driver and passenger. Uh, upgraded Burmester sound system, so that um, when you're playing your favorite song on the radio on, on a long road trip with some kids, um, you can really get them excited by playing the, uh, your favorite song uh, throughout the speakers. Uh, we come across to the uh, main control center here, the um, the infotainment center slash gauges. Uh, now this is all fully customizable right here. If I don't want to see the RPMs gauge, I can simply adjust that to see some fuel economy information, uh, navigation information. So in addition to being able to be customized that way, I can also change the way the um, styling of the um, gauges look. So with the blue design, it then turns to yellow and black. Uh, so lots and lots of different options. Um, on the steering wheel, you do have your driver assistance functions here. So this is where you're going to control how far you are to the car in front of you. This is also going to give you plenty of information on the lane keeping assist system with the two cameras up above here. Um, so lots of information here on the steering wheel, all easily accessible with your thumbs. So you're able to keep your hands on the wheel, keep everyone in the car safe uh, while still watching the road. Uh, automatic rain sensing windshield wipers it does have heated steering wheel, automatic movement. You can see that here. Uh, really, really a well put together car. We move over to the infotainment center here. This is all new for 2020 uh, Mercedes. They um, really did a great job with this. All touchscreen up top here, so I can simply move uh, my hand around like this, get to different settings. I can get to uh, navigation. Wherever I may need information from, I can easily access that right here. Uh, another way to control that is back on the steering wheel here, a pad very similar to the one I'm going to show you shortly. Again, very easily accessible. Uh, we do come down and you can see this beautiful natural grain trim. Uh, this isn't the glossy trim uh, that a lot of cars come in. This actually has almost a matte look to it. So this is gonna stand up to, to kids, scratches, toys, everything like that. Uh, very, very well, gonna be very durable. This car also has the ambient lighting. So 64 different colors here uh, along the center console, as well as along the doors and even into the back. So you're going to be able to choose one of the different colors. My personal favorite is sort of a blue or purplish vibe. And at nighttime, it really shines. Uh, that in combination with the Burmester sound system it just really creates uh, a very friendly, enthusiastic atmosphere uh, in the car. Further on down, we do have dual zone climate control. So driver and passenger can be at different temperatures. Or if you press the sync button, they can, of course, be the same. Uh, we open up the uh, center console. A little bit here up front wireless charging so if your cell phone um, uh, multimedia device has that ability pop it right on there and that's going to charge wirelessly apple carplay android auto hookup right in there if that's something you use it's very convenient uh, dual cup holders here these cup holders are actually heated and cooled so no matter what season if you're drinking a cup of tea cup of coffee you can help keep that cup warm um, if you have a uh, longer commute to work or maybe an iced tea in the in the summertime keep that nice and cool and fresh uh, further on back this is yet another way to control the infotainment center uh, it's a touchpad simply swipe back and forth very similar to what's on the steering wheel here uh, volume controls quick access buttons here um, that make commanding the vehicle very very easy uh, further on back we do have the adjustment for the air suspension uh, so if you're in some deep snow, mud, uh, whatever you feel like doing, you're going to be able to raise the suspension. Uh, and then when you get going on the road to help save fuel economy, it's going to bring the suspension back down. Uh, one more thing. We do have plenty of storage in here for, uh, you know, little knickknacks, whatever you may need, as well as some charging ports in there. Uh, panorama sunroof, front to back. So the kids in the back are going to love that looking out at night. Um, seeing the stars and things like that. I know that's always a, a cool thing to do. Um, okay, I don't want to take up too much more of your time. 
So we'll make it brief. Again, this is a 2021 GLE 580 with a big V8 engine in it. Um, like I said, just shy of 500 horsepower, so you're going to have plenty of power there. Um, uh, yeah, so I'd love to have you come in, Joe, and take a look at it. Uh, maybe take it for a test drive. Great car, great looking car. Um, and I look forward to working with you. So again, Sam Hersub here at Prime Mercedes. Uh, give me a call, text, if you want some more information on this. 207-831-7391. All right, take care. Thanks. Thanks.